favorite video and I think it's just because you don't like it. And I think my Probably. favorite sauce is barbecue sauce just because I know you don't like it. I think it. my favorite vegetable is carrots because you don't like it. Mm, Which is still good. super funny because <laughs> you know all the time still That's crazy. So. Ah, okay, yeah. chill, chill. No, <laughs> my eyes thought you were into <laughs> I guess recording. Is it recording? Yeah! <gasps> Woo! Woo! Yeah, it's recording. We're good. <laughs> yeah, we're in. <laughs> Welcome to the sit down podcast everybody oh, we're, wow, wow. we're in this bitch It's not the sit down It's a lay down podcast So if I I encourage you to lay down right now with me With y'all With with, with three of us If you're in the car And you're driving Just I encourage you to let go of the steering wheel Let go of the steering wheel Pull that shit time. down and just lay just down and just drive into that eyes. into that centerpiece crash <laughs> and just die. Whoa, that was Bro. weird. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I got kind of deep. Just, I've been yeah. watching too much Netflix shit. And just don't say die. die. Just, just die. Don't die. Just Disclaimer. Close, no, 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 no. If you just died right now and listening to my voice, hello now, y'all. I'm God. What's goody? <laughs> Bro, imagine, imagine if fucking, God you died. You died. You lived a long, full life. Christian, a Christian life. believer the didn't whole have fucking sex, time. You didn't waited drink, until marriage. You didn't, didn't drink. You up. went to church every fucking Sunday, and then you die, and you get to heaven. And he's like, "What's up, guys? I'm God." <laughs> no, it, was like, it was like you're walking up, and it was just, welcome to heaven. <laughs> and it goes, you know the, you know the um. What is and, it? And, the, and the security guards like, yo, you got red, red jeans on. No wait, you know the, you know the John <laughs> Cena. You can't come, you can't come into heaven. <laughs> you know the John Cena. You walk up to heaven's gates and goes, brum, 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 brum. you know the John no, Cena. No, but you hear it on the outside it's like. You got another Cause you're outside the of heaven. The bouncer's like, who do you know here? <laughs> you're like fucking God. Like, God, I know God. And you know, and you're like, God, oh, God, oh, oh, him. oh, you know God, know huh? Him. You know God, huh? You Prove can't it. Sit at my table. Prove it. Say the Ten Commandments. You're like, my table. <laughs> Commandments. Um, you only um, know seven, bitch. Go to hell. <gasps> and then you have to walk down the long ass stairs, and you're like, "Fuck my." And it's like, is. and it's it's my T Pain bartender playing. <laughs> when you get to heaven, it's like, I'm not the bartender. Ooh, oh, be looking for me. I'm, I'm at the bar with her. Uh huh. Okay. You guys know that so much better than I do. Because we were buffing on the way over here. I just watch. We're on, the, we're on the highway to hell. I don't I'm know. on the highway to hell. That one I know. That one I know. That's what you hear when you walk down. The wheeze on the dog. you was crazy. That was a wheeze that was whisper. A wheeze. <laughs> I feel like it was really loud in my ear. <clears throat> yeah. You're going to have to cut most of the Hold on, guys. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we Welcome to the sit down podcast everybody I had to just jump Mom. in here real quick Before everyone just hits Like not play anymore mm. I don't know I don't know what it is I, Like I don't know what stop. the not, What's the yeah stop yeah. Right, The back mm-hmm. button Because everyone's like alright I'm out of here Like this just sounds horrible <laughs> But I had to jump in and was like okay I hear this man's voice <gasps> She's smoking. Stop, 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 stop. Guys, 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 guys. Stop, stop. We caught her. We caught her. We caught her. Stop. <laughs> cut, 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 cut. Sorry. No, but anyways. Uh, <laughs> welcome to the sit down podcast. Um, we have one guest plus one. The second guest, guys. The s- God damn, bro. I hope if you're this listening to this on audio, one, just guys. tune in, tune in visual, please. <laughs> it will help out so it's much. Banging your head. Like, <laughs> head's all bleeding because he's banging on the wall. I've been you this? You hear this guy? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 can't do it i'm just burping right now Jesus <laughs> Christ. yeah it's bad it's big bad 
But anyways, guys. <laughs> um, so I have actually two guests here on the Sit Down Podcast. One voice you're probably familiar with because we've had on a previous episode. Let's go. And that was on season one. Episode 12, There's No Hot Water in Jail. Was that the name of the episode? That was the name of the episode. Oh my God, uh, yeah. Uh, Fun fact, everybody, people that aren't OG listeners of the podcast, if you're just tuning in this just to hear <laughs> the love, lo- the lovely Hannah Banana. That's and me. That's me. But, she and doesn't want to and you're just tuning in and you're like, wait, who is this girl in the middle? <laughs> I do. Well, this lovely girl in the middle is... The first lady of the podcast. The my first lovely girlfriend. Lady. Girlfriend. Girlfriend. <laughs> girlfriend. I'm my lovely girlfriend. girlfriend. My lovely girlfriend. That's my girlfriend. Um, <laughs> I like you never once me on the podcast. AKA, AKA since I'm saying, I can't even. I can't even finish the intro without them just bunning into like whoa, 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 whoa. the show I've been producing for over a year. You know, whatever. So when I stop talking, they don't got shit to say. That's you see what I'm saying, y'all. You see what I'm saying? Like I'm when for I don't questions. when I'm in the middle. Look, he's like, I'm waiting for questions. They're they're the worst students in the world. Like when it, you know when everyone's like interrupting class, when everyone's interrupt, interrupting class, and you're a teacher and you're just like, you know what? All right, come, all right, then Calvin, you come up and treat and, and teach class. And the guys is like, no, this is how it goes, ready? I'm a second grade teacher. Okay, go ahead. So I'll be teaching. I'll be saying something. I'll see someone not paying attention. I'm like, okay, doing? Santiago, what did I just say? And then it's like this. I'm like, oh, so you didn't hear what I just said, Santiago, huh? Sounds familiar. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Oh, hey, uh, is this at me? No, this is at Santiago. Santiago, this- if you're <laughs> watching this. <laughs> Yo. Santiago. This is at Santiago, if you're watching this, I sort of. God. <laughs> what did repeat? you just say? No, we're not going to repeat it. We're not going to repeat it. Yeah, you're right. That's fine. I'm gonna rewatch it like a hundred times as I edit. <laughs> it's so totally cool. Hand on the wall, you're like, ha, ha, ha. I wonder how much of this he's gonna cut out. I mean, if I can finish. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. What's your, I'm what's still your introducing. First I'm oh, yeah, introducing one of the guests. I haven't gotten into you. Oh my god, we okay, don't yeah. know who you. Oh are. Oh my god, we don't like, exactly. like, know who's on the phone. Like everybody on the sit down is like, oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my Who God. are you? All right. Um. Anyways, yeah, so I have my girlfriend so here. She's here. on episode twelve. Girlfriend. Now nah, she's here. My um, girlfriend, sir. And mm-hmm. the person I have. Mm-hmm. See, I'm just. Uh, anyway. Mm-hmm. Anyways, um, the girl next to her is Hannah Banana, <gasps> and that's why this podcast is so bananas. <laughs> Cause we got Hannah. <laughs> Um, well, anyways, I welcome Hannah Love Banana this. to the podcast. And how you doing? How you feeling, Hannah? I'm feeling great. Happy to be here. Not gonna lie. Oh my god, <laughs> we're feeling so good. This feels great, right? It feels so great. I wouldn't want it any other way. This feels like a Hannah ass way to do this podcast. Perfect. And our PJs just comfy on the table. I would not want it to be a sit down. I would want it to be a lay down podcast. Lay down podcast. We all have our black cherry white claws. We might black out and fall asleep during the middle of this episode. We all sleep well, if it just goes fall. quiet in the middle of this episode, we all fell asleep. Yeah, fucking stay tuned for our nap. <laughs> stay tuned for our nap. <laughs> we're gonna wake up. We're gonna be like, whoa, wait, wait. <laughs> we're gonna wake Stay up with our white claws our on nap us. is hilarious. <laughs> we're gonna wake up dressed in the middle of this pause, guys. Our Imagine. special, our special appearance is just us napping. <laughs> <laughs> we just wake up at six a.m. drenched in white claws. <laughs> and the like, camera's still rolling. <laughs> we're like, anyway, <laughs> it's been four hours. <laughs> Oh, All right, yeah, now. carry on, carry on. Mm-hmm. You're the guy. You're the man. I'm <laughs> <the> camera. Right? <laughs> Wait, the camera's gonna ask a question. I can't even take one. Huh? I can't even take one. Huh? How's it going? <laughs> it's going great. Wait, can you hear me if I do this? Can you? I can always. Hello. Yeah, yeah, you can hear me. <laughs> I just had to check. She I screamed. Had to check. I definitely could hear you if you're screaming the mic. <laughs> what if I go like this? Can you hear me if I go like this? I hear you right now. Hello. You can hear me? 
That's what he did. Uh, hello, I heard that bird. <laughs> did you hear that? <laughs> okay, wait. I can't wait. Hannah, learn. so you're a second grade teacher? I am a second grade teacher. Oh my goodness, y'all. You hear what COVID did? You, you just put her in charge. <laughs> Her in charge of your second year old. So if you're a mother of uh, second year old, <laughs> yeah, I'm in charge. How of all old you, are second, all you second year old? Year old. <laughs> second year old. Second year old. They're they're um six, seven, eight. Six through seven. When eight? I get when I get six, them in the seven? beginning, they're like. Six, so when an eight seven. year old's in second grade, they're kind of like. Well, well, well listen. I'm playing, I'm playing. When they come, yeah, they're fucking <laughs> held back. <laughs> Idiots. Just kidding. If you've ever been held back, viewers, if you have ever been held back, disclaimer: you, I none of this is real factional. You. I really hope you got this. Whatever part. that means, real factional. <laughs> no. So when they come into second grade, they're like six and seven, and then throughout the year they turn seven to eight. You know, mm-hmm. seven and eight. Mm-hmm. So yeah, it's a hot birthday party. How, that we do. Like, how I do they look? How do six to seven year olds look nowadays? They look like, so are they tiny small. and small. They're they so cool? cute. <laughs> They're so adorable. Hmm. Are they assholes? Some of them. Hmm. Some of them are assholes. <laughs> but I fucking nip that in the bud, dude. <laughs> when they come in, I'm like, all right, no more of that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you're not gonna be an asshole in my class. Now, now that I'm kind I'm of all hung wrong. over telling them, you're not gonna be an asshole in my class. <laughs> you're not gonna be an asshole in my class. I think the craziest part of being you're a not second be grade an teacher. Asshole in what class? <laughs> the craziest part of being a second grade teacher is that I literally <laughs> still go out so often. So I'll go into school just hung over as fuck, <laughs> and then they'll literally tell me they're like, "You look tired, Miss Nettie." And I'm like, those fucking facts. <laughs> I'm like, oh, you're I'm right. She said, those fucking facts. <laughs> I'm like, bro, teacher's house. Yo, one, shut the hell up. <laughs> I'm like, girl. <laughs> I know. I'm like, have you ever heard of She vodka? said, girl. Oh. I know. Yeah, I two times two. two is what? Yeah, no. Eight, eight, eight. <laughs> Two times two? Two times two is what? Eight? I'm like, probably. (laughs) Maybe. I don't know. What the fuck are you asking, Angela? I I never studied this. What'd you say? What do you even teach as a second grade? Like, Where do I teach? Yeah. Like, what school? What group? Or how? Huh? Huh? What'd you say? (laughs) I said, what school? No, not what school. What, like, I don't even remember what I learned as a... Six. Like, what's the curriculum? Uh, what's the curriculum as a second grader? Teacher? Okay, so Kyrie. for math. Okay, so right now what we're learning is coins. We're talking about a lot of Big coins. Yeah, Bitcoin in second graders no. are like invest 300 k. <laughs> Bro, we fucking invest in stocks all year long. <laughs> They're fucking rich at the end. By third grade, they graduate high school with hundred k. They're like, no, by yo, how valuable would, high, would school really be? If done how Dude, to do I literally, I wish like actual valuable information was in the curriculum. Mm-hmm. Like honestly, thinking, thinking back to like us being in school, mm-hmm. I wish they taught us stuff like that. Yeah. For sure, like we financial don't even know literacy, what a Bitcoin is. little things. I mean, at least little things. Yeah, like. Teach me how to freaking like write a check. I still don't know how to do that. I I like Google every time. Yeah, I don't know how either. Or do my taxes. Exactly. I'm still waiting on doing that. I, I do doing my taxes. taxes. I was just like, yes, yes, no, one, <laughs> zero, no, yes, yeah. zero, no. There's a lot of Did zeros. you use, um, what's it called? TurboTax for free. That's what free, I use. Free, free, free. This is not an ad. This is not I swear to God, this is not an ad. Jibro Tax, if you're listening to this, if you want to sponsor the Sit Down Podcast. For free? Feel free, feel free, free to do that, guys. Feel free, free, feel free, 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 free. free. <laughs> we just can't understand anybody. <laughs> Anyways, back to the question. I don't think I made sense. To teach second graders, not second graders, what are you even teaching second graders? Okay, okay so at the moment. Question, time huh? tables and TurboTax and Well, Bitcoin. not even really. Like, college okay, here's time, the thing. Just that. TurboTax? Know Fuck how to yeah. add and subtract positive the, and negative numbers okay. in a college class. In college really, classes? Yeah. Well, so what do like, you learn in second grade? Why am I, in this class? I don't remember what I learned in second grade. In second grade, it's right now we're talking about coins. <laughs> Usually it's like 
adding and subtracting within a hundred. So like using hundreds charts, using nu- using number <laughs> lines. God, I can't talk. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, my second grade class, if you're watching this, please stop watching. <laughs> but basically, right now we're talking about coins and like the value of coins, the name of coins. If I have this many coins in my hand, like how much money do I have? Stuff like that. Like that's what we're learning right now. I kind of remember that. So, and in, like, English language arts. So, you teach, like, every, <clears throat> like, subject. Yeah, well, okay. Are that's you a one great teacher? question, actually. No, the second One teacher for all, or do you, like... I'm supposed to. <laughs> I should be teaching uh, science and social studies. But science and social studies usually come in, like, just Sixth, randomly. Mm. I remember well, that, like, in eighth grade. Well, like, science and social grade. studies comes in randomly, like... Do you teach the China War and, like, samurais and shit? Huh? Samurais? Mm. Samurais? Oh. Actually, samurais? You don't teach about samurais and Oh, my God, this grade? fucking bed, dude. It's <gasps> Why are we sliding like that? I don't know. This bed is, like, as soon as I put my back on it, it's like... <gasps> oh! Yo! Can you pause this shit? We're still going. I mean, Jesus Christ. This bed is. Don't pause the camera. No! I just fucking punched it. Huh. Ready? One, two, three, jump up. One, two, three. Change <laughs> jump up. One, Hold two. Hold on. I'm just gonna have fun. That's too fast. <laughs> One, two, oh. three, jump. One, two, three, jump. One, two, three, jump. One, two, three, jump. Why did you push that side? One, two, three, jump. Oh my god. One, two, three, jack! Yo, this is the wildest podcast y'all have ever seen. Oh my god, this is X. I'm not gonna get through the camera. This is X rated, y'all. This is crazy. This is crazy. This is crazy. Is that what it looks like? Why can't I push it on this side? Is that what I look like? Is the funniest question I've ever asked, been asked in the podcast. Why is it not going? I don't know. Because it's blocked. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's crazy. Okay, now push. Oh, there Bang. we go. All right, let's get back in. Just, just <laughs> Bro, let's get back in. The lay down podcast is not because of the sit down podcast, there, I bet. There's such a long episode going on right now. <laughs> we have know. so much farther to go. We haven't made it any deep. We've talked about one thing and one thing only, and that's my students. Slip. I've only gotten in. I've, we're on the intro. Yo, welcome back to the sit down podcast, everybody. We got the seat back in the seat. <laughs> <laughs> we got that seat back in the seat. <laughs> All right, anyways, second graders, um, you're teaching them world world history. You're teaching them about China. <laughs> you're teaching them about Bitcoin. <laughs> <laughs> you're teaching them about who count. told you that? <laughs> it's just not count one, two, three. Everybody that just tuned in is like, what the fuck? <laughs> They're like, like what I missed. They're what? like, wait, I want to be in Hannah's class. Wait, 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 wait. You're teaching about, you're teaching about hangovers? <laughs> I'll take that I'm like, class. listen, here's what you need to know. Apple cider vinegar <laughs> shot. <laughs> Cures it right chugs, up. fool. What the yeah. fuck? Yeah. I'm like, you're trying to get drunk quick, second graders? <laughs> oh. You're trying to get drunk quick. Butt chug, <laughs> second graders. <laughs> I'm like, you won't need to know this right now. You want to know the <laughs> secret and, and one finger? Butt chug. Butt chug. <laughs> Butt chugs. Butt chug, one hey, can, word. Can I get two? <laughs> Butt chugs? <laughs> Can I get three butt chugs, please? <laughs> That's how you do your time tables. <laughs> is three, this four? I don't three count. times one is three. <laughs> <laughs> I should honestly start to do that. Here's my thing. When I took this job as Whoa, a second grade teacher, we're getting serious now. We're getting serious. serious. This, this, we're riding into deep thought, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Actually, when I took this job as a second grade teacher, okay, I seriously had no idea what I was doing. <laughs> And now that I'm several months in, almost at the end of the year, you know, fully experienced, been doing this for a while, I still have no clue what I'm doing. I still don't know. I have no clue what I'm doing at all. So whatever recommendations you have, this is probably better than what I'm doing right now. To be wait, wait, wait. So, so what's like the job application for? Like, what? What's it, not for. What do you mean? What's it about? 
the job application. Like you're just like in on Indeed and it's like second grade teacher. You're like, bet. Okay. Like, like, okay. Yeah, listen. Actually, hired, it's pretty yeah. cool. You want. No. So there's instead of using Indeed, there's something called EdJoin. <laughs> And the, okay, I all right, roll I your eyes like you shit. Like I hate everything about like that shit. Like so, they're like, we're better than Indy. No, no, we're no, no, no. Ed join. Ed join. Ed join is just for teachers, so it's just like easier because I don't have to go. Like, listen, no, listen, because I fucking get discriminated on. <laughs> um, what's it called? Indeed. No, the other one. That's like a social media thing. Instagram? No. No, LinkedIn. LinkedIn. <laughs> I tried to make a LinkedIn one time. I was like, you know what? Let me just see what are the teachers Fuck are LinkedIn. going on. LinkedIn's all about Link- like jacking uh, there's off nothing- everybody. Like, okay. cool, you need to be jacked off. Cool, you need to be jacked off. I, I don't know about all that. This bed's still slipping. I don't know about all oh, that. that. You're the best. But basically, <laughs> I tried to make one because uh, I was you like. You need jacked off. Oh my god, this bed's yeah, fucking slipping, yeah. dude. It's okay, it's a lay down podcast. Even a, so it is lay down. I tried to make an edge on right now. I'm trying to hold it down. Like an anchor. I tried to make an anchor. That's an anchor of the show. What did right. you say? Anyways, LinkedIn. I tried to make one. Okay. Because all my friends are like, I have a LinkedIn. <laughs> I was like, that's cool. Maybe it's another social media thing. LinkedIn is trash. Well, I I tried to make one. (laughs) And then when it says, like, click your mm, career, education was not on there. I had to exit out of the whole website because I was like, okay, I'm not welcome here, obviously. So, (laughs) welcome EdJoin. It has, like, all the teacher jobs. In mostly in California, mm-hmm. and that's all you need to know, basically. <laughs> that's it. It's nothing exciting. So you applied, and what happened? Like you're just like, cool, Hannah. Yeah. Great job. It's like, okay, so do you did you ever do like the Common App in high school when you were applying for colleges? Not at all. It was like for like UCs or CSUs or whatever. I, I wish I could junior college like a loser. <laughs> No, that's not a loser. Stop. My mom works at one, so you're insulting my mom, stupid. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> he said, I love Wendy. I love Wendy. Yeah, stop insulting Wendy. She has great frosties, I'm not gonna lie. But anyways, Wendy's. Right. Wendy's. You caught it. You caught it. You yeah. caught what I'm going for. Basically, Edjoin is like Indeed, but for teachers. That's what I use. It doesn't really work very well. I. Every single like every single teaching job that I've ever gotten was like the day before school started, <laughs> so it doesn't really work super well for me specifically, I guess. Mm. But I hope that answers your question. So like you apply to like what like a handful of jobs? You apply to one? Or you apply like how you applied to like ten hundred right. jobs? Well, okay, so. And it was just like right before they like, all right, you're hired. And you're like, what's like what, literally. What okay. So class? basically the past few years I would apply for like so many jobs and so like in different school districts. And then during the summer, like late, late summer, they're like, okay, we need a teacher. We like, we like, we need to figure out before the first day of school. And that's when I come in and say, okay, I got you and I'll come in and do it. Mm-hmm. Ideally I would get the job before then but and that's know. what ed join is for is like finding teachers for the different mm. like teacher spots that are open mm. yeah. so the teacher had to like go on vacation for like 12 months yeah like <laughs> so basically like and the first like it. that year that i graduated college that first year mm-hmm. actually i don't know if i use ed for that Might have to cut all of this out to be real. I'm so sorry. (laughs) But basically, that first year that I taught, that teacher Mm -hmm. went on maternity leave, like, early. So Uh, they needed a teacher for the first day of school to fill in for her. Uh And that's, like, I took that job. And I got the job literally the day before school started. So the first day that I walked onto campus and saw my classroom was the first day of school. And I, like, I walked into campus as my students were walking in. Mm-hmm. And we were all like, sick classroom. And I was like, yeah, this is a pretty cool classroom. <laughs> Guess I'm teaching you in it. Like, that's how it went. Wow. You're all sitting yeah. in Yeah. And then the next year, I got the job in October. And school starts in August. So basically, it was like, mm. I'm coming in late. And this year, I think it was like oh. the first day of school, too. So, so really, you had like... I mean, as far as other than your, like, obviously education and shit, but, like, you never got, like, no formal <laughs> like, training. training. For 
Well, just put you in the classroom. And well, like, so I went to school for education. Right. Mm. Which is hands on, I assume. Or yeah. No. So like, so I had experience before my first day of teaching well, ever. I mean, in order to get the degree, don't you have to like teacher assist in mm. classes, things like that? Yeah. So like, you have to take like all so the classes. That, tests, yeah. So that might, it might be a little bit like it sounds kind of wild to like maybe me or you, you know. But mm. like as a teacher, like it's kind of like. I feel like a teacher degree is more than anything else. Just like super hands on. Yeah. It's almost like a um, what is that called? Uh, like a, a technical school? Like not technical. I don't know what it's called. What like, is it called? Um, I know what you're saying. You know what I'm saying? Um, like a like if you go to school to be you don't mechanic, go to college, but you go to like trade school. Trade school. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. Going, getting your degree for teaching is almost like a trade school. Like because it's you, super like you're hands learning on. about it, but then mostly most of the time you're actually in a class working under a teacher. Yeah. So it's a little different, like because when you come out of college, you're like actually when you come out of college, I what I what it seems like you can correct me if I'm wrong. What it seems like is like you're almost like at your most ready coming out of college because you have yeah no that's like, true like you're fresh off that shit like because I know true. like I know when I came out of college like if you told me to take a typing test if you told me to like test out like a psych theory if you told me to do anything like I'm a you remember it easily smack. Yeah. like I'm gonna kill that shit yeah you know but so, yeah yeah like going to school for teaching it's a lot of like theory like oh in it's theory like psychology, when you're yeah, in the classroom sure. like this is how it'll go and then you do get some like experience with it so like my first year of teaching ever or my first year of college sorry ever we had like one semester where we'd like go in like yeah. once a week maybe and like observe or something so then it would just keep building 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 every year of college we would go in more and more and more right. yeah i kind of heard that through my teaching yeah like, and like hanging out with teaching like education major yeah so like senior year we had um our student teaching semester you're almost taking control of groups correct yeah, yeah yeah where it's like you plan lessons you like have to write all these lesson plans blah blah, blah. but basically like all the theory that you learn in college about teaching is mm -hmm. pretty like like doesn't matter like once you're in the classroom once you have your job and you're in the classroom it's like all right like you try to remember as most as you can but you have a whole new set of kids and you have to like change your teaching according to them and like how they learn and right, everything right. so it's like all right like you learned so much about teaching but now it's like you're just thrown out there and do whatever you can mm. and like all the lesson plans that i had to write in college those are not the same that I write as a right. teacher. Yeah. So it's a lot. I like it. I like teaching as a teacher better than teaching as like a student learning how to teach. Because the student learning how to teach is a lot more like technical. Like you have, like to, you have fill to get in everything all the right. Blank. Yeah. Like you're, cause you're, exactly. You're still trying to get a grade yourself. Exactly. Like I'm a student who's also teaching. But right now I'm a teacher who like I can just focus on like teaching for the kids. Mm -hmm. You know. Do you feel like you're in a? I mean, we're not gonna say where you're at, but like, do you feel like you're in a good district right now? Yeah, know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because my um, stepsister, um, stepsister in law or whatever. Um, she's a she's a teacher as well, and mm -hmm. so I know like she always kind of emphasizes like being in a good district is very important because mm -hmm. you can be stuck in a bad district and like not have that like support. You, like that. Yeah, not have support. People, other teachers not might like you. Whatever it is, maybe yeah. whatever maybe like if you get stuck in a bad district, like it could be it could change your whole situation. Yeah. So like my first year of teaching ever, I was a long term sub. Mm. For basically the whole year, so I was practically their teacher. What's for the it whole like year. being a sub? It's like stepping so in for when else. so my first year of teaching, I was a long term sub, mm. and it was from August to March, so it was basically the full year of teaching. So it was practically my class. Like I love those kids so much. Like I think about them all the time. Like I love them. You know, it was but, that was your first class, correct? Huh? Like what you're talking about is your first class. Well, because like, I was a sub, I don't consider that as my first year of teaching. Right, right, right. So okay. this year is my first year of teaching. Mm -hmm. But that year after I graduated, I was a long-term sub, and, like, mm -hmm. I had them forever. So 
that's like close enough to me like they're like in my heart still as like my first students Mm -hmm. but that teacher who's on maternity leave that i was covering for she had everything planned Mm -hmm. so i was teaching them but i didn't have to really plan anything that much like i just followed her like strategy like i would find like activities that went with what she said that went with like okay this day do this i would find the activities for it but like I didn't really have to plan anything myself, <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah, you fucking. I was like, <laughs> I was like, I was already sleepy. If you guys are you know? listening, we all just slept right now at the at cat. Yeah. Who is dead ass asleep? What are you talking about? Cat was And it just was kind of funny because mm. everybody noticed. <laughs> I she woke up in the middle. I didn't my story. <laughs> so. oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, anyway. she's like, I want to come on with Hannah because she's my best friend, but like, Loki's just kind of boring. I'm a fuss. No, let's, <laughs> just, <laughs> let's talk about something else. No, I'm interested in this. And I, I'm sorry, I'm sleep doing everything. everything. Right. I just got cozy and I right, right. She's cozy. It's the right, cozy right. sit down, it's lay cozy down, sit down. I'm in, no, 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 <laughs> Hannah, but I honestly, Hannah, I'm asleep. interested. I'm definitely interested. You see, I'm I not am engaged. Too. I am too. Yeah, I just um, want One thing I wanted sleep. to know, though, like, um, how, which, like, how do you feel about, because it's your first, <laughs> your first year of teaching, right? Like, officially, that's what you said. Yeah. Um, how do you feel <laughs> about this whole how pandemic has impacted school so much like this is yeah i think this right here is a very important subject because um i hear about it as well like i told you earlier like my sister-in-law is a teacher as well and what grade does she teach i want to say uh, second or third grader second or third grader so she's in your same same age range um she's in the bay area um hayward to be exact I won't say her school just district, just in case. I don't know, but she's in the Bay Area. Hmm? No. I said another white car. I said no. I'm drinking whiskey. We have a lot of drinks here. Um. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. So how did but, the pandemic affect? Yeah. How has the, how's the pandemic affected Sorry. affected everything? And how do you feel about like you know California kind of holding schools in a little more like? Which is just kind of your whole like thought process around like everything know, schools not being in session, schools being halfway in set. I because I don't know how it is in your district. Yeah. Because I know like in other districts, schools are like ninety ten. Some schools are like fifty fifty. How is it for your sister? Um, she's. I think she's mo. She's like. Oh, I think right now in the Bay Area, she's like a hundred percent online. Like she doesn't. Oh, really? really see her class. Still online? Well, because she's in Hayward, so I mean. That's right next to SF, and I don't know if you have like paid attention to everything, but like SF was kind of almost like the New York of most of the pandemic, like yeah. as far mm-hmm. as like epicenter. Mm-hmm. So like Bad. the Bay Area was really hit hard, um, <laughs> and so like the Bay Area right now kind of takes it like the most serious out of California as far as where I've been. I've been like kind of here and there throughout California, and I mean I haven't really been to the LA area. So I don't. I can't speak on like how they're taking care of things, but mm-hmm. I know I've been at the coast. I'm in the Central Valley. I've been in the Bay, and I know like the Bay is kind of like like real restrictive yeah. on things like that. And I know the school, especially like, has been super like restricted, restricted up there. Yeah. So, I don't Plus, know it's more it. liberal up there too, and they're it's more cautious. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think um, so. For me. For the majority of the year, it was all distance learning, which means most of the kids were at home the whole time, Mm -hmm. or all of the kids were at home for the most part. So for me, I could work at home for a lot of it, and I wore sweatpants every day and like a Mm -hmm. shirt, like a nice shirt on top, Mm -hmm. and... You only have to meet with them, like, a couple times. Mm -hmm. So, for me, I meet with them, like, half an hour. Or during distance learning, it was, like, half an hour, break, half an hour, break. So, it was, like, an hour each day, not consecutively. (laughs) Um, So, it was super nice because I love working from home. I love waking up, rolling out of bed, and then teaching. Like, it was super (laughs) nice. But then, like, you start to notice, like, 
it separates like the kids who are doing the work and who are like diligent and who have that support from home and who are doing their homework, blah, 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 everything to the kids who don't have that support. Right. Mm-hmm. So you start to notice the kids who are falling mm-hmm. behind and then it's like, dang, like they're really not learning anything. Mm-hmm. Like they're stuck in like first grade kindergarten. Like they're really so far behind. Mm-hmm. And then recently we switched to hybrid, which is some kids are in person and some kids are online. So I'm teaching like both at the same time. Like I'll be on my computer with some kids in the classroom and some kids online. Mm. And there's like two groups of that. Yeah, at the same time. Oh, that's weird. So it's like, and it's, uh, it so sucks because this might be hard to explain over this. But like, it's seriously so sucks because it's like, in the morning, I'll have kids online, kids in person. And then in the afternoon, same thing. A different group of kids online, a different group of kids in person. So it's like I'm teaching the same thing twice each day. And it's just like it really sucks for me as a teacher to like do the same thing twice a day. Yeah. But. And because people already ask a lot of questions. Like and you already have to repeat yourself. So yeah. Twice already. Twice exactly. Exactly. But <laughs> it is nice because one, the kids who are in person who like are coming in and like taking that risk, blah, blah, blah. Like they are like they're taking the risk but they're getting that extra reward they're getting that extra benefit and like they it, like some so of them crazy need it to, like shy different mm-hmm. person's extra reward now i know and it's like it's so it's like it is really complicated because you want to give <laughs> all of your kids that equal opportunity blah 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 but those kids who come in person like they just get like that extra like Mm-hmm. TLC like they get the extra like Hands support on. and help and yeah like I can walk around and like check how to like see how they're doing blah blah, blah. whereas the kids online like they're just they're online sometimes yeah. and it's like I'm helping them still I'm there but you it know, must be so hard too because I know like <laughs> when I was over I, I was recently at my um, <laughs> sister, um, sister, I keep, uh, my sister-in-law's house um, I think she's transferring districts and I and as she was hopping on one last time to say like bye to the district she was at mm-hmm. and just hearing all the little kids voices mm-hmm. like I didn't see none of their face I didn't see I was on the other side of the wall but hearing their voices I was like damn like they sound so like cute and Young. enthusiastic yeah. and all this stuff and I'm like fuck i can't even imagine their faces you know what i mean like if you had a be right there in their faces like and like you're literally like watching them struggle literally watching them maybe like not only struggle like with the coursework but struggling with like, Everything. not having you there not yeah. like being at home all the time maybe you kind of like get a peek at like where they're living and you're like yikes you know uh, yeah I mean? like, exactly like, that. like and it's just like I can only imagine, like, you get to, like, see all this stuff now, and it's just, like, like, it could be... Like, teacher. this is not how it's supposed to be. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, seriously, like, I definitely get students where I'm, like, are you okay over there? Like, I, like, take a peek in. Like, so, for the most part, when my kids were all online, I would have them all muted. Like, we would be on the little Zoom call, they would all be muted, and I would just teach and I'm like, I can't hear anything like classroom management, like me, like disciplining them wasn't a thing because like they what weren't like do? doing anything like, yeah, like it was, they were all muted, but when they would unmute themselves to answer a question or say something or whatever, like I would hear all the music and all the background noises and like everything. Like I would be able to hear like, okay, they're not like, they're not in a position to be in class right now like I can hear all of the like their siblings or families or whatever like I can hear everything going on and that's when I tell them like okay like go to a different class like go to a different room like do you have a room that you can go to that's quiet like this whole year has been so stressful because I know that they're just not learning Mm -hmm. like as much as they should be Mm -hmm. and a lot of them are not doing the work that they should be doing and when they're in person I can tell them like okay, like, make sure you're doing your work, blah, blah, blah. But 
once they like log off of the meet, if they're at home, then yeah. it's on them and it's on their parents and their parents didn't sign up to be teachers. Like they're not teachers or parents. So yeah. they can't teach their, like their children. So it's definitely been hard. It's definitely been really, really tough. And like, like the kids who are now in person, I'm just like, all right, like these are the ones that I like need to actually like focus on because they're the one taking the risk, you know, mm. if that makes sense. I get you. No, yeah, I get you. But it's crazy to hear, like, it's, like, the risk. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, I know it's, like, I guess the ages we live in. Um, but it's just, like, we all would have that, though. You know, mm. we would all be there. You know, I just and, feel like, bad for, like... our teachers and yeah. learning hands-on and, like, even, like, the ones that were acting out would still get, you know, the hands-on you know by the teacher like you still mm. get that help you still get all that stuff and like because i know me as a I didn't, I didn't really like become a great student until about like sixth or seventh grade mm. you know what i mean like throughout yeah. elementary throughout all that stuff i was mm. like you know like i would be the talkative kid i would be the wild and out kid i'd be the talk back kid mm. things like that like and i don't know if i especially during this time like and it's kind of funny because I'm listening to it like now firsthand, like, because I know I hear like my nephew who was a sophomore going into junior year, like lost his junior year, lost his senior year, things like that. But if you go back even farther, like to like, like second, third, fourth, fifth grade, like all those years, I would fuck off too. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, and that's normal. You're eight years old. Like, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. What do you But expect? being at home and having just like, especially like, well, you're, you were a teacher at that point, but imagine like a, like a long-term sub, like, cause there's subs in this position right now, hopping in like on live, and on like, Zoom. like, okay, here we go. Like, yeah. Imagine being like, you had a teacher at like for a little bit, like, okay, that helps a little bit cause you have a familiar face, things like that. But then. You're a sub that hops in, and you're like an eight year old. You're like, what the fuck's this guy? Like, I know. What the fuck's this girl? Like, like just log off. Yeah. Like, I, like, I seriously, I cannot imagine being a kindergarten teacher during this time, because not only do you have to teach them how to read and write and everything, but like they have to figure out how to work a computer at like yeah. five and, and six especially years a lot of, old. A lot of kindergarten teachers are old. Yeah, like, and like. Oh my gosh, I remember the first, like, so I had a few meetings before the first day of school, and it was just all the teachers coming into the meetings, mm -hmm. and there was this one teacher who had been there for years, mm -hmm. super great, experienced teacher, but she was older, so technology wasn't... Her strong you know, suit. Yeah, her strong suit. So I remember by the end of the day of one, like, one day few meetings she was like i'm i'm exhausted like i can't do this and i was like this is such a learning curve one for the students but two for the teachers and like definitely for the parents like it's just it was it's just hard horrible. it's yeah. hard all around i mean because I, I i go to my brother's house you know that's where my steps not my sister-in-law is mm -hmm. and she's a teacher and you know her classroom's in the kitchen like she has yeah you know she kind of keeps try, she tries her best to keep it like looking like a classroom like if you were to look like at in the, the camera, camera yeah you know she has like like all that stuff in the background that makes it kind of look like a classroom and things like that mm -hmm. you know but like she's just like man i wish it just would go back to normal. i know, you know it's what I mean? tough it's it just is like tough you are seeing like like you said like you're seeing like the like the dissonance between the people that have or the kids that have like the support that have mm -hmm. the technology that have like the capabilities to learn through how how they're learning mm -hmm. and then you see the kids that and aren't the ones that are not and you're just like cuz like they can't see it themselves like the kids but you as a teacher who can see everybody, you're just like, fuck. I know. Like, yeah. Like, you're in this nice. <laughs> like, like literally, you see the living situations. Like, I never really thought about until right now. Like, I'm sitting down with you. Like, you can see, like, damn. Like, you're in this nice-ass house. And then you look down. And it's just like, fuck. Like, you're. You're not in this you're, situation. You're, like, yeah. in this one-bedroom apartment with, like, four kids. Yeah. Like, I've had kids who when they like unmute themselves to answer a question it'll be super loud 
in the background. Yeah. Yeah, like music or the television or their family talking or someone on the phone. I'll tell them, go find a quiet room to go to and they'll move. And one of my kids like literally moved to their closet. And I was like, it broke my heart, honestly, because I was like, I have a great space for you to come to. Like, you should, like, I I wish you could come here. Yeah. Like, it's so, it is so sad, like, seeing, like, looking in on their lives and seeing how, like, how it's just not conducive to learning and how their parents are not there for them the way that I would be there for them or how, like, their parents don't prioritize education like i'll have kids who come into the meeting and will be in the car and it's super laggy and they can't hear anything and i'm like what's the point of being in like it's just it's so hard and so sad to see their situations and how some of them like a lot of them their their parents don't prioritize education or prioritize their learning Mm -hmm. so like now that some of my kids are in person and some of my kids are online still, I just the other day like had the office like call some of those at home kids, like call them and say like listen like your kid should come back to in person like I have so like I have a few kids who like just still can't do it at home and it's so sad like mm. this whole year like for some of them was a like good year like they did okay like they they're were right doing it yeah they're they like the they're all right they're okay but for some of them it's like oh my gosh that really set you back so much like i have this one kid who when we do math like i'll say okay like count like count by tens to 100 and that's like something that we've done in kindergarten before and he can't do it like he's like it doesn't like he'll go like one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 12 like he just like can't remember 11 like it's just like all these uh it's so frustrating it's so sad it's so sad Mm. so it's been a hard year for sure not even a year but like we're we're bleeding into two years now i know exactly like two years and like i was actually having this conversation earlier and i was just like we're not gonna see any of these effects of like two years stripping away from these kids like honestly like if you're I think if you're like 21 and younger, like you, you're really feeling it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like 21 and up, like you, you kind of have some shit kind of going for you at that point. Like, you know what I mean? If you're 21, like, like you were in college or you're out of college or whatever. Like, I feel like if you're 21, you have somewhat of an identity of yourself Mm -hmm. like you know what i mean like that you can like work around you can work around like that's kind of like like, okay i can't go to the bar for a few months like fine you know yeah you but like you know who you are yeah you have some education under your belt you you can lean on your identity as a person Mm -hmm. like you're like okay like i know i am this person like i know like you know at at 21 is the youngest like you might not exactly know but you have an idea Mm -hmm. like you're like okay i can lean in on like you know what i know i'm a good worker i know i'm a good communicator i know whatever it is right like Mm -hmm. you can lean in on these type of identities that you might have out of yourself at 21 like that's a responsible age to kind of have somewhat of idea of yourself Mm -hmm. you know but like if you're 19 18 19 18 you still might not gonna lie but if you're if you're dipping into 17 16 15 14 13 12 the younger 10 you have literally no idea about who you are yeah you know what i mean like if you're 16 you got two two years stripped off of you now you're 18 and it's just like not only are you 18 you you have these like embedded pressures on you like all right you graduate from high school so what are you gonna do mm-hmm. you go to college you work you know yeah, you have to make like, all these important important decisions. decisions at 18 right but then if you're 14 well now you're 16 and it's like now you have to start thinking about these things and it's just mm-hmm. like okay well what am i gonna do like <laughs> Yeah. And you got two years in it. So you keep going younger. You keep going younger. Like you're 12, you're going to 14. Now you're in high school and you got, you had six, you had seventh grade stripped away from you. You had eighth grade stripped away from you. Now you're in high school. And now it's like, oh fuck, like I'm in high school. 
Yeah. Like, what the fuck? How did this happen? I just think back to, like, like the little kids, though. Like, the little, little kids where it doesn't, like, there wasn't a graduation in between, like, Mm -hmm. second to fourth grade. Like, there's nothing really important that happens in between then. But just for them to be like, oh, this is life. Like, this is normal. Like, but, like, oh, those two happens. years matter, though. It seriously matters. And the Second fact to fourth, that they're like, this to is six, normal. Sixth to eighth, eighth yeah. to freshman year, freshman year, junior, junior to senior, like... Everything, like, these years, like, growing up, being in elementary school, middle school, high school, like, these years are so, like, fundamental they're years. Crucial. So, especially for the younger grades, like second grade, my kids are like, Miss Jenny, like, when does, like, the coughing virus end? Like, they, like, they know about it, and they know that it exists, and they know to wear the mask. Like, they know, but they're just like, when does it end? Like, they don't really, like, know exactly. Like, they don't know that this has never happened before in our lifetimes. So, Like, like, we don't even have the answers. Yeah, and I'm just like, I don't know what to tell you. Like, I hope it ends soon. Like, I hope I can see you soon. Like, it's just, they are just so, like, this is life. Like, they don't really, they're missing out on so much, and they have no idea why. And it's so sad. Or, Or even what they're missing out on. Yeah, exactly. And, like, so they just, like, some of them just came back to in person, like, very recently. Are you awake? So some of them just came back to in person like super recently Mm. and they'll see the kids in the other second grade class that they didn't see in the little Zoom meetings and they're like, oh my gosh, like hi. And I'm like, you miss out like and even just like them coming back and I have like in one class, I have like five kids who come back to in person and like just their little side conversations that they have that's like. Oh, like I did this this weekend or blah, blah, blah. Like just like the little stories that they have that they don't get to have when we're all in person. It's just like, okay, class time, like math, ELA, log off, do your work, you know? They don't, like now they're getting that. It's kind of funny because it's like, it's like in, in like class before COVID, it was like, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, focus on your studies. Like don't, you know what I mean? But now it's like, the conversations that happen within class within your peers are like the most important yeah you know what i mean like it's kind of like the i'm not gonna say the class clown but like the you know like the side conversations mm-hmm. that happen in between exactly. students like is like almost that that shit is extinct yeah you know like the conversation you had with your your best friend back in the class Yeah, like I miss the passing of notes in class. And yeah, I miss the class. Oh, that's how me and Hannah were. That's yes. how notes in, in class, and that's how we met hands. Were that's hands. how we became friends. Was like we pass notes in history. Like mm-hmm. just those little things that the kids are missing out on. Mm-hmm. And like right now, like they can't share papers and they can't share pencils. Like they can't. Like they can't share friendships or love. Exactly. Like they have nothing. <laughs> they like it's just like. All of those fun, like all of those little details that you miss out on when you're in school, they're not getting those, and it breaks my heart. My arm fell in the abyss. I know. There's can I move the bed? I actually, you know, it's funny though. I've been wanting to have a teacher on. Yeah. Have some teacher conversations because my, my, like I said, my sister-in-law is a, a preschool teacher or a secondary teacher or a third grade teacher or whatever teacher she is. I know she's <laughs> below fifth grade. Some kind of I know she's a below okay. fifth grade teacher, um, and I hear her concerns, and and it feels like I can't do anything, you know. And I, st- I mean, it's not like I'm doing anything now, but you know, at the very least, I can still understand. Understand, and I can yeah. still try to put out. Well, like teachers are going through. Yeah, cause I and it's like I can only imagine like. Like, and, and I really got a glimpse of it too. Like, I was just there on Wednesday, and when I was there on Wednesday, like, like I told you earlier, like, she was saying, like, bye to kind of her class, and it was just like hearing those voices and. Yeah, how young they are. How young they are, and how, like, yeah. innocent and everything is. Like, all yeah. oh, like, electronic, like, on the computer. Yeah, and I didn't, yeah. Even get, I didn't get to see them, I didn't get to see what, like, what their background was, I didn't get nothing, and I just got. Quick glimpse of just hearing their voice and I'm like, damn. 
dang, like, they're little kiddos, like, mm -hmm. they're small ass kiddos, like, yeah. and they're navigating through the world just like we are, but the only difference is, is they don't have, like, any control. Yeah, like, and they we, don't know what they're doing, like. Yeah, like, we as adults, like, we have control, like, if we want to, like, you know, fuck this, like, we're going to do whatever we want, or, you know what, nah, I'm not going to do that, or, you know what, like, I'm going to yeah. go and do this, like, as kids, like, you don't have that decision. Guess I go to school online now. They're like, not getting like their social life. Like it's just. And that's really what like, it is. Like, like, we'll, we'll get after this. We're almost done. We got like ten more minutes. We gotta okay. fill in for the podcast listeners because I know y'all like to listen to an hour episode. So here we go. How'd y'all meet? How did we meet? Oh. oh. They're listening. Anyway, so I met Hanny Banani. I, I, the first time I ever saw her it was in class. We had AP class together, and she walked in with her little, her little blonde hair and her, her little glasses and her little cardigans, and she would walk in, and I was like, oh, Hanny Banani is so cute. And we never knew each other, never talked the whole year. We did not talk the whole year. And so basically, like, let me explain real quick. <gasps> Freshman year, real quick. I had braces and glasses yeah. at the same time. <laughs> I was so, so nervous to speak in front of people. <laughs> oh my gosh. You're so cute. I like seriously, I just sat in the back of the class and just listened. And then when we had to give like speeches or presentations or whatever, I remember specifically one day. Yes. I remember specifically. <laughs> one day we had to memorize poems. Do you remember that? Yeah. So. I had to remember, like, we had to memorize, like, Romeo and Juliet poems. Oh! <gasps> those poems. No, no, wait. Was, that, one, that one was better for me. But we had to, like, write something and then present it. Yeah. And then I remember, like, my voice, like, I, like, my, like, you know, when you're talking and then you just kind of, like, choke on saliva? Like, I, like, and it sounds like you're crying because you, like, choke a little bit. Gross. And my face got so red. I was so nervous, and then I choked. It seriously looked and sounded like I was crying. <laughs> and that was like the kind of a five. That was it. Like that was freshman year. I remember. <laughs> that was like the worst part of freshman year. And like I sat in the back of the class, and then I did that, and that was it. And that's probably how you remember me. Huh? I remember because me and Hannah we met. In, in in history class, that one history class we took, and then the we sophomore year. Yeah, that's when we kind of met though. Like that's yeah. when we first started talking because I sat behind you, and then we would pass notes to each other. And then also we had to <laughs> remember what our song. All of the all slaves. slaves. I like, still talk all about of the slaves in here. Baby. All of the no, slaves. No, no, no. It was, um, it was oh, you know, my podcast canceled. No, all no, no, the slaves. No, no, no. It was, it was historical. It was supposed to be. Yeah. So history. it was like you know the song "All the Lights." It was called "All, all of the, the Lights in Here, Baby." No, we're not extra bright. I want y'all to see it. You know that song? All the slaves, baby. No, no. We would say yeah, it all of the it slaves are being traded. Trade was basis of the um, Portuguese Portuguese relations. Dude, it was a song about the f and I wouldn't I wouldn't sing that if I was young. We no, didn't it. sing it to the class, we just shared it to our teacher. Racist. It was for It was it was not racist at all. It was it pure was. His, history. It was because it was for history class. I don't know cool. how we like I don't know how we like picked each other to be partners though. That's a I think I think like as like I was in the class and then you sat behind me and I think like you turned around or I turned around like whoever was in front like we're just like hey I like my name's whatever hey what's up like that's just how we met was like because we sat next to each other like we did and we started talking and we hated our teacher yeah we hated our teacher and we would make comics about him yeah I found those I have a few too and they're like cringy they're so cringy. We but, like, I'm in a history class and yeah. 
sec like sophomore year, that's how we became friends. And once we were sitting in <laughs> we were sitting on the next were we we were next to a table. We we're next to a table. I believe the, the cake. <laughs> it was red velvet. <laughs> red velvet cake. Yeah. The the day that solidified our friendship was we would we were such nerds, dude. We would like Perfect. hang out. This is crazy. We were just like, like, like the really scary, the scariest. This story this really freaks me out every time. Dude, because I was like, I was so innocent, so timid, <laughs> so was, scared. You're not listening. In high school, listen. That's how you listen. No, yeah. wait. You have to be with you. You're, you're the owner of this. <laughs> I'm no house. longer the owner. Y'all are the. Well, no, the listen. Show. No, no it was like me software. On a band with no, listen. Everybody wants to say it to a lot of time, you baby. <laughs> Extra bright, wish y'all to see it. Yo, they're the host of the sit-down podcast now. <laughs> Passing us the torch, we have to take over. You guys are the torch. Okay, well, listen. Yeah. I'm listening. It was, I think, sophomore year. No, we're not saying that. No, it's a good story. story. Why can't I close my eyes but Kat can fall asleep the whole episode? Because I've heard this story before. You have to let me know the story. You haven't heard it. It's a good story I'm telling you. Alright, it better be fire as fuck. It it's not that fire. It was fire for us as sophomores. Comment um, below, let me know if it's fire. Okay. It's sophomore year, we were like, Kat and I were so timid, so shy, so like nerdy <laughs> little girls, okay? Right. So that's what you say. I'm that's, yeah. that's it. I'm we about to tell you. Oh, oh, I like it. it, I like it. Do it, babe. Do it, babe. Show me, show me, show me, show me. What are you showing me? Mm -hmm. This. Cheers. No, I don't like me. <laughs> what happened? Where's your other one? What? Did you just butt chug the whole fucking can? Mouth chugged. Babe, do it. What? He went. Look. You see it? What's My foot. Ew. <laughs> my squeals? Dude, this that was squeals. That was. Anyways. I hope the microphone was true. Go ahead, tell a story. Okay. Okay. I think it was sophomore year, right? Yeah. Sophomore Damn. year. Damn. That was years ago. Years ago. ago. We were so, like, we were just y'all got wrinkles. Like, we are different people, dude. Okay. We really were. We were now in the English so building. Sophomore year like, was 2012. Yeah. We were, we're those talking 12 not or nine no. years 12. ago. 12 or 11, dude. So we would be. 12 or 11, dude. 12 or 11, dude. So we would, Can like, during lunch listen. break, we would <laughs> hang out in, like, seriously, the English building. Like, right outside of the theater classroom. Like, that's where we would sit. We were such little tiny nerds, okay? That's oh where we're so nice. We're so cute. We're so little, so cute. Losers. So it was me, Kat, Audrey, Sarah. We would sit on the floor right there in the English building. Right across from us was this other group of girls. We were a little bit gay. The rivals. It was like, it was like. The rivals. It was like a few oh, gangsters scary. and like. You already like scary, babe. What do you this, want to like, say? Like, 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 story. It was like, listen, you're scared. not listening. It was like three gangster girls across from us and one super nerdy girl, okay? Ooh. And we were always like, how do they belong? We don't know. Hmm. Anyway, one day, it was one of their birthdays, right? Wasn't it their birthday? I think so. Or was it our, one of our birthdays? No, I think it was. I think it was like Sarah's or something. Like yeah, that. that's yeah. right. Or something. That's right. It was, it was, it was one of our birthdays. birthdays. It was Sarah's birthday. It was our friend. And so one of us, is it you or Audrey? Probably Audrey, made her birthday cake in this red velvet. Just because you guys knew? Well, it was like, we knew it was her birthday, so Audrey made her cake. And it was like, happy birthday. Like, it was so wholesome, yeah, really? innocent. We put the cake on, like, the table across from us. And where the, the corner. Where the scary like, girls <laughs> sat. Where the scary girls sat. Where they sat, we put the cake scary there. Scary girls were at. Yeah, the scary girls sat there, but they were gone. Like, their backpacks were there, but they left to go the use bathroom. bathroom or whatever. Listen, listen, listen. So then, like, then we're going crazy or something. I don't even 
really I remember it now. Yeah, I think I was talking. Like, we were talking, and then one person kind of like leaned up against the table where the red velvet cake was. And then it tipped the table. Like, the legs just folded in. It just, in. like, folded. <laughs> and then, like, red velvet cake slid and landed on the... We all, like, on, all of us on just her watched backpack. on her backpack. Like, we just watched the cake go from one side of the table slide all the way down. Slid and off. And flip, like, upside down and land perfectly on all their backpacks. And like, we, we all, all just red watched Red velvet it. stains. <laughs> Dude, red velvet stains. So it's what it fell. We just watched it slide. We just watched it slide and fall like, on their backpacks. And they were so scary. And like previously <laughs> we had all like we had been sitting down and they had been across from us and they were like talking shit to us. And they we're, were like, yeah, you're right. right. Like we were like so taking out in a little fight with them. Before this like, or after? It was with the phone call, remember? When she well, was, was like, because the... she got on the phone call, she's like, I'm talking to my, like, she was talking to someone, and then what are the we were girls? all talking, and then she's like, I'm talking to my mom. And oh, then Audrey was like, then go outside. Yeah. And we were mean, and we were all like, ah. Like, Audrey wasn't afraid to, like, talk shit <laughs> back, but we were like, uh, yeah. 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 She's like, so so then go outside. We were all timid. She's like, Sarah was timid. Audrey is less timid. She did not care. But when something, but when like something actually happens, she's like, shit, like let's get out. So we basically, all, when the red velvet cake slid off the table, fell on their backpacks, it was right before class, and we ran. We just took all our stuff. We left. grabbed our stuff and ran. Like that's the like quickest. We all like split up different directions. <laughs> Bye. See you in the next class. Like see you at the next period. We, we like care split what happened to up each other. left. We just left. And then I don't think we ever saw them again. <laughs> And so what? That was like the most epic like moment in high school. Okay, you have to understand oh, he's that our dog. senior year, we were such like like Kat and I especially like we were like the little innocent, timid, I didn't do anything scared wrong. girls. We were so neat, so nice and sweet. Like we didn't do anything wrong except accidentally drop a cake on someone's backpack and we ran. And I was like, they were gonna fight us. It fell. I and seriously they were gonna thought we, we all just left. <laughs> like as I, as we could. I don't think I've ever thought I was gonna be beaten up before. Be up, beaten up, whatever it is. And except for that moment in my life, I was like, they're gonna notice and they're gonna destroy <laughs> all of us. Except for little nerdy Bonnie. <laughs> except for nerdy Bonnie who was in that group for some reason. But seriously, there was one random girl that was just so dirty and like. So nice, so adorable. I yeah, like, I was like, you were not long. But anyway, we were friends before that, but that's when it solidified that we were in it for life. Right. Like, you so, get beat up, bitch, I get beat up. We didn't get beat up at all, but we, we just all ditched each other. We didn't care yeah, if you got I was like, bye, go to class. We all went to class. Yeah, but you guys survived together. Yeah, yeah. bro. We, like, we, fucking, we dodged prison we together. Prison. prison. <laughs> But we fucking practiced dropping the soap together. We did. Yeah, dude. You don't want to hear that? Story. Yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> Watch the video. All right, guys. Questions. Um, this has been the weirdest sit down episode that y'all tuned into. <laughs> it was so serious, and they got so not I'm so, serious. Uh, I'm sorry for the disorganization of this episode. I know you guys tuned in because you like. The well organized organic conversation, which it was this episode for sure. <laughs> it didn't end that way. Uh, and if you're watching this on YouTube, it's been really weird for sure. <laughs> so if you listen on videos, I mean audio, it's probably a bit more weird. I'm fighting with my girlfriend right now. Hands hands on. Um, hands on. Hands on. Hands, hands on fighting. Hands. That's me. Abusing. She calls me hands. She calls you abusive. Hands. Yep. Anyway, <laughs> anyways, guys. Um. Thank you for listening to this podcast, but how I like to end every podcast is by giving my guest the time on, their last time on the mic, okay. and basically what that means is, you know, you can talk to your future self, you can talk right. to your family, you what can do talk most to your people fans, do? you can, you can plug yourself, fans. you can talk to your maybe second graders that might listen to this when they're fourth grade.
<laughs> if but, you are my second racers and you're listening to this in fourth grade, I advise you, please <laughs> don't <laughs> wait until you're in sixth grade. But, but anyways, <laughs> yeah, it, it's your last words on the mic. I mean, you can talk to your future self. I don't know. However you want to attack it. What do most people do? Most people talk on, to... Poo. <laughs> most people talk to poo. <laughs> What? That's question. Wait, what? You just stopped in the middle. Did you fall asleep? Yeah, like, let's answer the question now. Okay. Oh my god. Alright, let me sit up straight for this, I guess. I have no advisement on this one. But if I were to talk to my future self, I would say, hang in there, Hannah. <laughs> You're doing great. Look at you now. You're on a podcast. <laughs> <laughs> you're on YouTube, bitch. You got this. Am I allowed to say you're Am I allowed to say you're He'll bleep like that out, right? Well, you're probably not. Shooters. You have to turn out a super Shooters. Loud. Yeah, I would just say. <laughs> yeah, if I were just to have <laughs> last <laughs> remaining words, I would just say. I hope you guys are doing great out there. I, I love all of you. She's a great TikToker. Sometimes. Oh, uh, I have a TikTok. I, She's really good at it. Do you so? Follow my TikTok. I think it's a Hannah Denny D and an E Y H A N and A H. All right, we'll just link it below. We'll 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 link all of my social media below. We're linking our Uber driver. We're linking Hannah. We're linking you. We're linking you. This girl right here is teaching your kids, everybody. So you better start moving them to a different school district. Anyway, good night. All right, guys. If you listened this far, I fuck with you. If you don't. Haven't listened this far, then fuck you, because you haven't listened. You haven't listened to this anyway. Um, also, actually, I have another guest here. Do you want to say anything else? Go ahead. I would just like to say goodnight, and it was really great talking to you all. Like, I love being here on the Sit Down Podcast. Lay Down Podcast. I love being on the Lay Down Podcast. It was so cozy here. I might have, like, closed my eyes for a quick second, but I love it here. I just let you all know that. All right, cool. You guys know my favorite. Ew, I hate that was crazy. Um, that was really crazy. <laughs> <laughs> it's been me, your honored and humbled host, aka OMG. I'm sorry for this wild podcast, but I hope you guys tune in next week and you guys are still here. Peace. Good to see that podcast.
Oh, yeah. 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 Bananas. We're about to go bananas, dude. We're about to go bananas with Hannah. Hannah's a banana. banana. That's so weird that you're Correct. saying banana because I had no idea that she was banana. Yeah, I thought she was banana. I had no idea. RJ? Because 
Yo, the, it's the matches are moving. The matches are the 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 moving on. It's like BAM! Oh, no. the light. <laughs> I'm sorry to scream in your face, guys. But, <laughs> dude, I'm telling you, you need to tune into the YouTube right now because this shit is bananas. Oh my god, oh my god. Because it's Anna Banana. That's right, <laughs> and that's on period. That's on period. And that's Shout out Aubrey. <laughs> Shout out Aubrey. Audrey, she's gonna get so mad. <laughs> she's gonna get so mad. I. <laughs> Remember when someone called her Adrian? Adrian. Yo, you know what it is though? I feel like no, because you know what it is. I feel like I remember her more pissed off than I remember her not pissed off. Oh my god. Bars. <laughs> okay, that's as good as. Because I feel like she's. They just went back. <laughs> that's as good as. Yo, Aubrey. Get Aubrey. Aubrey Drake. No. I need everyone to hot. Up all, right, all right, over their ass. Right, In three, um, two, one. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. I, this, this just feels. Hold on, hold on. This is just like really awkward. Oh, the pillows are all sinking. I know. Well, I didn't think. Why are. <laughs> Bro, I, had just, I had McDonald's just before these guys. Bro, this yeah. lay down podcast is about to be a fucking so Wait, move that pillow. I feel too. so awkward. It's so <laughs> weird, guys. Move that pillow. Oh my god. Move that pillow. Oh, why is that pillow like that? <laughs> Guys, oh my god, it looks like a fucking fuck. I'm honestly. It, honestly. Look at my stance. Honestly. Yo, guys, yo, guys. Tune into the YouTube right now. Ew. This is weird. Don't do it, don't do it. Don't do it, don't do it. Don't do it, don't do it. Because if you listen to audio, this doesn't make no sense. It's right here, I'm sorry. Okay, alright, here we go. I'm sorry, guys. This is Alright, alright, alright. Anyways, guys. Sit down and whisper. It's not even recording anymore, guys. Oh, it's oh. awkward. Okay. <laughs> We're just fucking doing it for fun. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? It's just red. What does that mean? What does it mean? What, what is it's red? It's recording. What does it mean? Where so that means we just did a whole like freestyle for nothing. Oh, dang. Video only. Ba 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 bang. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. What it's I don't know, like, how to just move the set mid set. Which is. Look, I'm unplugged. Why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? Hello, hello, hello. So look at the. Oh, it's not red anymore. Use. So this is weird. This is mad weird, guys. <laughs> We're just so drunk, we don't even know what's going on. <laughs> Ours is plugged in. Alright, well, welcome to my and Hannah's Sit Down, Sit down Podcast. podcast. <laughs> <laughs> it's <not> recording, guys. <laughs> <laughs> the video's recording, so this might be some YouTube shit. Oh, shit. Hello! 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 Oh, 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 What is that? Fucking what I want. Are you swinging it on the fun one? I just swallowed it. No, babe. Your dance was just like. Like, let me throw the V sign. Oh, that was so weird. Your dance was just like. Yeah, this is podcast dance. Oh, that's so weird. Oh, that's so weird. This is podcast, not OnlyFans. Oh, that's so weird. 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 Oh, that's so yeah, exactly. But you haven't set up for OnlyFans. So oh, crazy. now we don't have the porn vibe. Now we have the porn vibe. Should I let him follow me? Yeah, fuck it. <laughs> I don't even know what's going on here. Um, Is it recording now? Can you hear us? Hello, 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 hello. How can you hear us? Hello. Testing, testing. One, two, one, two. <laughs> what do I need to go do? Do you want me to fix something? Um, random, we'll call it random Hannah. That's me. That's what they mm -hmm. called me in high school. <laughs> random <laughs> Hannah. <laughs> no one knew me for who I really was. You're so random, so they didn't know who you were from you. That's from true. You. Mm -hmm. Little did they know that that was really <laughs> just constantly just improving everything. Mm -hmm. it was random Hannah coming by. <laughs> coming by. Who's coming by? Random Hannah is coming. Coming by. <laughs> Who'd you have one with Hannah? Hannah. Random Hannah. Oh, oh okay. yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 I knew it right in the very least. <laughs> 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 I 
Tahu apa tahu? I actually literally can't say that dog as you know. I just hate that dog. I don't know why. I don't know why I don't like that dog, but I don't like that dog. I seriously actually don't know why I don't like that dog. That's my favorite video on 